This video is going to help with uh, serving as a tutorial for the rectangular pattern feature in Activity 5.5a CAD model features. As we look to continue on through the activity, we're going to take a look in the activity document. They want us to go through and practice the rectangular pattern feature as we've gone through and uh, used it in the 2D side of Inventor, but now we're going to go through and use it also as well in 3D. So they want us to create a 6 inch wide by 4 inch wide high rectangle and extrude the rectangle to a depth of 0.5. So that's the first thing we'll do. In Inventor I'm going to create a new sketch and constraining to the origin I'm going to go through and draw our rectangle and we'll draw our 6 inch, six inch wide by 4 inch high rectangle and from here we can extrude it to a depth of 0.5. So this will serve as our plate here that we're going to use to to create a rectangular pattern and it says use the following image to draw a circle to the dimensions that they have specified so it looks like we're going to have a 0.3 diameter circle that's 0.5 away from each edge from the bottom uh, lower left hand corner. So I'm going to create a new sketch down here on the front face of the plate and I'll probably need to project the geometry if it's not already there of the um, plate itself. I'll put in a circle and the first thing I'd like to do is I always like to locate the dimensions first of where we want this. So this will be 0.5. This will be 0.5 as well and then we've got a dimension of 0.3 for our circle. Once we have that we'll finish the sketch and checking our document they go through and they really don't specify an extrusion depth as we go through and we and we take a look so we'll go through and kind of create our own. So I'll click extrude I'll choose my circular shape 0.5 seems to be a little much we'll go through and put 0.25 in there and that seems to work out pretty well. So main thing is is we're going through and learning how to use the rectangular pattern feature in Inventor. So within pattern on the 3D side we'll use rectangular and the first thing it wants us to pick is the features. I'll choose the little cylinder that we extruded off of there. For direction 1 I'll click on the arrow to tell it what direction I want to go in. I'll first go over to the left or to the right so looking at left to right and we're going to need six of those spaced at one inch apart from each other and then, then when I'm done I'll go through and look at direction two so if I click on direction two now in the case of and just like how we on direction one it does want to pattern down off of the plate if I need to flip the direction I can choose the little option next to the arrow that says flip and we're going to put in four of these and they are all going to be spaced at one inch apart as well. And I'll go through and click OK. When I do that, the rectangular pattern will pattern those parts in the directions and at the spacing and the number of parts that I've gone through and chosen. 